Hey everybody. Well, I am home from work today. It is flooding in St. Louis, let me tell you. So we have flash flood warnings going on right now till like three o'clock, which I think it's almost three o'clock now. But um, I came home early because I work in a flood zone, so it's kind of getting serious. So I'm here, but I wanted to touch base with you on my plan that I've been doing today and yesterday. Because I said I was going to start yesterday, Monday, and I did. Um, I've done really good. I have uh, been on track. I have done my weighing. I've done my measuring. I have stayed at my points. I have been logging my foods. Um, so I'm super, super, super stoked. And this morning when I put on my scrubs, I noticed that they are getting bigger. They're bigger in the legs. They're bigger across the chest. Um, they're bigger in the arms. So it's happening. Yay. So I'm super excited about that. And I'm very happy that I'm able, I don't know if that's right, but everybody nuts or not, but I'm very happy that I am able to um, start feeling it in my clothes. I told you, scales, sometimes I can really care less as long as I'm in a smaller size. So I'm getting there. Yay! Um, and let's go over what I had the last two days. So Monday, I kind of touched base on what I did. But you know what? Monday night, I did not do so good because of the fact that I had cereal before I went to bed. So that's not good, but it is what it is. And I was still within my points because I still had points left over, but I ate and went to sleep. So that's not good either. So, um, I also, what else did I have? I had something else. I don't remember. I don't know. But, you know, I did this morning, um, I had avocado toast, which was very good. And I had a fourth of an avocado on a piece of whole wheat bread. And I used the great value, which you guys seen in my grocery haul. And that was one point. So one point on the great value. And then I had um, tomato with that. And the fourth of the avocado I took and spread over the bread. So that was good. And I had some cottage cheese and blueberries. Then for lunch, I had a steak salad. So I had two ounces of steak. And I had some romaine lettuce. And two tablespoons of cheese, shredded cheese. Cucumbers, tomatoes with two tablespoons of blue cheese dressing. So that was a total of five, like nine points, eight, nine points. I forgot what the phone said and I can't check because I'm on my phone. But it was eight or nine points for that. So, and I still have a bunch of points left over. So for dinner, I'm planning on having chicken and um, green beans. And I still have a half of a baked potato left from the weekend. I might do that. We'll see how many points I have left and where I'm at. For a snack, I'm going to go in and have some blueberries and cottage cheese here in a second. So I love that. I absolutely love that. It's like a dessert. <coughs> so um, I just wanted to touch base. And tomorrow I will show you the scrubs, what I'm talking about, as far as like them being um, bigger on me. I, I really did not think that I was going to get to where I'm at because I have a picture I am saving up. And that picture, I look at it and I'm just like, I shake my head and I'm just like, I paid a hundred bucks to have pictures taken when I was in Florida for um, my real estate that I was doing down there. And I got them and I cried. I was like, what the heck is all of this about? So I, <laughs> I'm i looking forward to um, getting to the point to where I will show you. I don't have that same dress because it got trashed. It was 
So um, I'm looking forward to showing you the picture versus another picture. But I'm going to show you my scrubs tomorrow because you guys have seen me in my scrubs. So you'll be able to kind of compare. And you know what? I'm erasing pictures as I publish them on here on YouTube. So that's not good because of the fact that now I don't have them to reference back to either. So I got to be more cautious about that. So I can kind of see the before and the after, you know, that that helps me be able to make sure that I'm staying on track good. So, um, yeah, so I, I'm getting there, guys. I am getting there. For dinner, I'm going to do chicken, like I said, and maybe that baked potato and the green beans. For breakfast tomorrow, I have planned out. So what I did this morning when I woke up, I made out a... Um, food a food plan a meal prep plan so the meal plan um i'm gonna do an oatmeal tomorrow because you know oatmeal is good for your cholesterol it's good for your heart so i'm gonna try to do every other day eggs so i'm not eating eggs back to back to back to back so um that is what i'm going to have tomorrow is some oatmeal and maybe a piece of toast i'm gonna try not to that bread just kind of, I'm going to try quitting the bread, but I have a whole loaf, so I might as well eat it up. And it's one point, so it'll be okay. Um, So anyway, I am actually happy to report that my clothes are getting big. Here's Buddy. Say hi, Buddy. Hi. <laughs> um, That the clothes are starting to get big on me. So that is makes me happy 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 so i have my mojo back so i am not going to be upset tomorrow at what happens with that number on the scale i do need to buy another scale because my scale's starting to have a little issues um it's not wanting to measure um the weight i get on and it it's like error error and then I'll move it and it'll give me one weight. I'll move it again and give me another weight. So I got to find a new scale. So it's Amazon days today and tomorrow. So I'm going to look on Amazon and see if I can find a nice scale. Hopefully it is going to be, um, trying to figure out where the best, there we go. Hopefully it's going to be on sale and it's going to be cheap. I'm hoping anyway. So we shall see what happens with that but the scale and i have some other things in the works that i have been thinking about and i have some changes coming up in my life i am not ready to talk to about them yet but i will soon and um i'm getting settled here in st louis i am i just told um my friend, that I'm, I'm actually starting to enjoy being home now. Um, I got my stuff yesterday. I got it yesterday, the day before I got the letter finally that I've been waiting on. Remember I said that I was having problems getting my, my license plate and my driver's license. Wow. I got really dark circles. Um, getting my driver's license done so I finally got that form. So now I can go and get that done. Hopefully I can do that on Friday. I don't have to be to work until um, Friday afternoon at 11. So that will give me time to get that all taken care of. So, you know, I'm an optician, right? These glasses that I have on, these are transition. Transition means that they change when I go in the sun, right? But these are a mirror transition. So if you can see, there's kind of that little mirror that's happening um, on it, my other glasses are not doing so great. So I got to I'm gonna have to get a new pair of glasses. And where I work right now, I used to get free glasses every year. I get one pair of free glasses and now I don't, I have to pay for them. I get like 20% off the first pair or I have VSP like, um, vision insurance. They still don't cover all that much when you're talking about because I have a progressive lens. I have a um, no-line bifocal. So it doesn't... <laughs> See the blue? Oh, Jesus. So anyway, 
Um, I got to work on getting a new pair of glasses. So I am trying to get things kind of going for myself and trying to get myself situated. And I've been doing a lot of praying um, and a lot of like talking to God because I need his guidance right now. I needed him to <laughs> help me be able to figure out what it is that I need to do in life, right? And I know it's him who's helping me get this weight off too. So I just want to thank God right now for everything that I have. This apartment, you guys remember when I moved in, I had absolutely nothing in here. And now I have a home. So I'm very, very, very grateful. And I'm very, very thankful for um, God providing me with what I got. So... I am hoping that I can get some things going this week. And when I start getting the little changes happening, I will be sure to fill you guys in. You know, sometimes I feel like if you say something too soon, you kind of jinx yourself. So, but I will give you the tea on this Life Over 55 with Kim, right? And if you're new to my channel, please like, subscribe, and share. And stay tuned because tomorrow is Weigh In Wednesday. And we're going to see exactly where I'm at. Because I told you last week, I did not weigh, I did not measure, and I did not keep track of what I was eating. So I couldn't tell you if I was on target with points, if I was way above points. If I have no idea. I know I had a lot of sugar. I know I had a lot of bread and I know I had a lot of fast food and the fast food is what puts weight on us, right? So until tomorrow, when we meet again, everybody have a great day. If you are in any of this flood area, um, I pray that everyone is safe and sound tonight and I will see you guys tomorrow. Like, like subscribe and share. Mwah! Bye.